All right. <clears throat> Let's go to another node, which is the HLR. We agreed that the HLR is short for Home Location Register, which is the database of all the network. As any subscriber on the network is available on HLR. Now, what is the subscriber data that is stored? Like MSI SDN, which is our numbers, the IMSIs or the IMSIs, the location area identity of all the subscribers. And at the same time, it also stores data like supplementary services like call forward and call bar. Okay. I just don't want people to get, all right. So um, I don't want people confused with HLR and VLR. VLR is a database in the MSC. And in this MSC only, but HLR is a database for all the networks. So again, the difference between HLR and VLR VLR is a database inside the MSC. And in this MSC only, but HLR is a database for all the network or all my network. Plus HLR is a standalone node, but VLR is a database in MSC, not a standalone node. The HLR is involved in some functions or signaling messages that have to do with the telecom that happens in the network, meaning that it supports in authentication and supports in location update. It also has a role in call management or in the call itself by going back to HLR during the call by knowing from HLR, the subscriber I want to call is attached on which MSC. So this is an important part. Again, the HLR is involved in signaling messages that have to do with the telecom itself that happens in the network. So it supports in authentication and in location update and has a role in call management or in the call itself that it goes back to HLR during that call and knows from the HLR, the subscriber I want to call is attached on which MSC. 